Last time I gave Trump's. <laughs> when the shot was fired, Maya, I mean the defendant, was not getting ready to strike, but was actually squatting low to the ground, just as I had done moments ago. <laughs> it was all part of my research. <laughs> order, order. Th this changes everything. <laughs> <laughs> the smell of the room. <laughs> Please look at this diagram of the crime scene. It's a stick figure of you <laughs> farting into the screen. <laughs> Pay no mind to this detail over here. <laughs> hey, I'm Grump. I'm not so Grump. And we're the Game Grumps. Die. Hello and welcome back to Game Grumps. Yeah, oh yeah. It sounds like you're trying to write an Alice in Chains song, but you don't know how. Yeah, I'm gonna die. <laughs> yeah. Okay, we'll uh, we'll take that one into consideration. No, I got I got the best song for you guys. Chugga, 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 chugga. I'm gonna die. All right, Aaron, please. <laughs> All right, we're please. back. Yeah. Here we go. This might be the break I was looking for. You break me off a piece of that. Fucking... Oh. Can you imagine somebody opening this episode? I think who's never seen Game Grumps before. They're like, I'm gonna check out what Game Grumps is all about. It's just like, yeah. Larry, die! Break me off a piece of that Kit Kat. <laughs> 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 yeah, they're like, these guys have been around for 12 years. I. <laughs> Probably something to justify that. <laughs> Let's have some experience in this field. <laughs> okay. Like 90 seconds in, they're like, that's enough. <laughs> okay. Yeah. I I don't know, man. What? Oh. I would insist it's not Maya. Yeah, of course. Yeah. It's, it's not fucking Maya. Yeah. It's obvious. Your Honor, as you can plainly see, the person in the picture is not Maya Fey. Yes, I see that. Well, good. <laughs> it's not just her face. Her whole body has taken on a different appearance. And what part of her body has taken on a different appearance, Judge? Do you surmise? I'm not the one on trial here. <laughs> <laughs> There's only one conclusion that can be drawn then. That somehow this other person snuck in and traded places with the defendant. You know, I feel like you can pretty easily go from here to there. Because it's like, oh, how do you prove... Uh, this clairvoyant medium like transforms in it. There's literally a fucking grown woman standing next to him who used to be a child. Yeah, but she's also on the other end of the room. No, she's right next to him. No, but I mean, supposedly the person who, uh, supposedly Maya got shot through the robe near the screen on the other side. Right. You know what I'm saying? So, like, it's possible that it's still two different people and not just, like, Maya channeling this woman. Oh, I see. Yeah. I don't know. We'll, we'll find out. That's true. That somehow this other person stuck in and traded place with the defendant! Oh, yeah, Slap, slap, slap. <laughs> order, order, order. Well, yes, I believe you are correct, Mr. Wright. The person who was inside the channeling chamber was not Maya Fey. Man, we did it. You're, you're too soft. Huh? You're softer than on Morgan's strawberry desserts, Phoenix. Here, the, the one let me around help. the knife? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> let <laughs> this big on Honkaroos help. Take a look at Prasad's She's smiling. That damn smile. I think you had better continue to worry, Mr. Phoenix Light. Miss Von Karma! What do you mean by that? Your Honor, I would like for you to take a look at this picture. Duh. <laughs> <laughs> this was taken yesterday at the detention center's visitors' room. This is Mr. Phoenix Wright and the defendant, Maya Fey, during his visit. Maya Fey? But isn't this a totally different person? Whoops. She looks this way because she is obviously in the middle of channeling a spirit. Whoa, whoa, whoa. It's unbelievable that she can... Yet it is the truth. When Maya Fey is in that state, she physically changes into the person she's calling. Ring-a-ding-ding, -ding, hello. <laughs> Oops, I'm you now. <laughs> <laughs> Miss Von Karma, a word, if I may. Mia? Taking pictures of someone doing a private visit is illegal. Surely you must know that picture can't be submitted as evidence. 
I can't hear you. <laughs> Obviously, I know this picture is illegal. But I never intended to submit it as evidence in the first place. What is she? From the moment I showed this picture to the court, this case became all mine. All mine! After all, this image has now been forever burned into the judge's mind. <laughs> I don't have even a single witty line. It looks like we've been had. I don't claim to understand this, and I still cannot believe it. Are you saying that this person, this person is the defendant, Maya Faye? If I give up here, the trial will end. But if I slip up and say something wrong, it'll it will cost, cost me. me. Is there any way I can prove that the person in this picture is not Maya? Uh, yes. Really? You can prove it? Yeah, she doesn't have a bullet hole in the sleeve. Oh my god. Aaron, you're a freaking genius. Your honor! Oh, the fire has returned to your eyes, I see. And those rippling pecs. <laughs> this picture. Within this picture lies a critical contradiction to all the testimony up until now. A contradiction? So, you think you've spotted a problem with this picture? Then earn your keep. What are you? You dumb bitch. <laughs> A point is a finger. <laughs> Aaron, Aaron. <laughs> Please, a little maturity is necessary. <laughs> Please direct your attention here. To the victim's butt. <laughs> but, <laughs> but there isn't anything odd about it. Wait. And that is exactly what is so odd. The fact that it is not odd is why it is odd, sir. Allow me to explain more. <laughs> Something that should be there is suddenly missing. Should be there. Oh. Uh, uh, <laughs> uh, is this what it feels like to get whipped? <laughs> there was a bullet hole in the sleeve of the defendant's costume. If that's the case, then it should be in this picture as well. Should I say costume? I feel like that's disrespectful to their, like, whole religion. I don't know. I mean, at this point, we're just trying to sort out talking to ghosts and murderers. Yeah. Miss Von Karma, you... You intended to hide this valuable piece of evidence? <laughs> you will most certainly be assigned a penalty for this. <laughs> All right. <laughs> 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 Love to hear it. <laughs> My <laughs> mouth is bigger than ever. <laughs> this is do some major damage to her <laughs> argument. Want to know how I got this smile? <laughs> Don't celebrate yet. You like to bring down the mood, don't you? Take a look at Miss Von Karma's face. She's still pretty happy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, she's got that condescending grin plastered all over her face again. Tsk, tsk, jumping the gun again, I see. Your Honor, I would like to extend an apology on behalf of those incompetent fools. What do you mean? And what incompetent fools? <laughs> me? You're yeah. not talking about me, are you? <laughs> If, if those fools down at the precinct hadn't missed the bullet hole, I would have gotten a report about it. As I didn't, I could not have known that this picture was of any value to the case. Hmm, I see. She's lying through her teeth, I know it. That woman knew everything about everything. Took the <laughs> bullet hole in the picture, everything. Always touching each other and making all playfully with each other. Always <laughs> being all playfully with the pictures. <laughs> But you can't prove that. Francisca von Karma's idea of a perfect case is quite fascinating, don't you think? Your Honor, you need not worry. If you must assign a penalty, I'll personally make sure the detective gets what's coming. <laughs> Good <laughs> Lord. I'm sure there will be a great gnashing of teeth at his next salary discussion. Poor gumshoe. <laughs> In any case, this is a very big problem. When the defendant was taken into custody, her costume had a bullet hole in its sleeve and butterfly wings. And despite all my rage, I'm still just a rat in a cage. However, from this photo, it would appear that right after the shooting, there was none. The judge is confused by this strange twist of events. He's confused by everything. <laughs> this is your chance, Phoenix. Load all you've got into this one shot, all right? I got it. Watch this, Maya. <laughs> click, click, bro! Your Honor! She can't be the murderer because it was the candle. <laughs> <laughs> Mia's like, what the fuck? 
Alex, oh my god. <laughs> you shoot her someone else. <laughs> the defendant's sleeve had a bullet hole in it. However, this person clearly does not. There can only be one explanation. The person who the the person <laughs> <laughs> who shot Doctor Gray was the defendant was not I'm, the de defendant. Sorry, I should. That's important. <laughs> but a different, but a di but a different person altogether. <laughs> that would have been a lot more effective <laughs> if you just read the words correctly. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? My thoughts exactly, Miss Von Karma. <laughs> Fucking anime speed line. Get ready for this ultimate takedown. The defendant was not the uh, with the defendant. <laughs> Holy shit. Order, order, order. <clears throat> Sorry, I found my voice. If order is not restored, I will suspend this trial. Ah, 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 ah. <laughs> the, defense's, the defense's argument is a complete mess. <laughs> this really is a comedy game in a lot of ways. Hey, fitness. The fitness. <laughs> What the heck? Is there anyone to ask a gal a favor? <laughs> Be quiet, you. Oh you were the one who said it was only the two of them when you entered the room. You stupid bastard. Well, you know... If you were lying, I swear that my whip would be the last thing you see. <laughs> Look, sis, you're looking like mighty scary, so why don't we say, Ah! I swear I wasn't lying or nothing. That, this can't be legal, what she's doing. <laughs> yeah. There wasn't anyone else in there. Honest. You see, now riddle me this, Mr. Phoenix Wright. Where did the defendant vanish to? And where did this other woman appear from? Behind the, the thing. Behind the thing. Why? Uh, why is it lately all I want to do is cry? From the sides of my head. Fucking same, Phoenix. <laughs> well, if the person in this picture is not the defendant, then this poses two very big questions. One, when's lunch? <laughs> and two, <laughs> one. Where's lunch? <laughs> <laughs> First, where did the defendant vanish to? And second, where did this person come from? <laughs> That's right. Now hurry up and answer, Mr. Phoenix Wright. Come on, you can't fall apart here, Mr. Phoenix Wright. I can't believe that even me is calling me by my full name. But, I mean, how am I supposed to prove something like this? Had enough yet, Mr. Phoenix White? Or do you think you have enough in your turn- in, in you to turn- to turn things right <laughs> See? <now>? It's not <laughs> easy! <laughs> Sorry, I was thinking about something else. <laughs> to turn things around. Every now and then I fall apart. <laughs> That's right. You would always turn things around and change her perspective. Phoenix? <laughs> so where does this intruder? He's like spinning in circles. <laughs> it's not working! <laughs> Phoenix? Phoenix, what are you doing? <laughs> and where did Maya disappear to? I'm getting dizzy. <laughs> I, need to look at, I need to look at this situation from a different angel. Let's see. What if before we broke in, the third person was already in the room? And what if Maya had left that room somehow? If I could prove that either of those conditions were true... I've got it! It wasn't Edgeworth on the boat! No, Phoenix, that was a different case. <laughs> Mr. <What>? Wright... <laughs> let's, let's hear what you've come up with. I think what happened before we forced our way into the channeling chamber is... A third person had entered it. No, Maya had, had left. left the room. Yeah. yeah, I think so too. She had the key. Oh, the key is the key. Yeah. Maya had left the channeling chamber at some point, and the defense could prove this. Oh, how a foolish fool makes a foolish face while dreaming foolishly foolish fool dreams. Please stop. Maya Fay was being looked at after by her aunt Morgan Fay. Whoosh! Uh. <laughs> mm. Mm -hmm. The chances of her leaving the crime scene is lower than the detective's. Okay. Anyway, <laughs> let's see some evidence. Okay. Prove that from the murderer, until the time of arrest, the defendant had left the room. The key! The key! <laughs> it's a dream! Ms. Hart, do you remember this key? No. Uh, oh. well, I've seen it. 
Hey, that's the channeling chamber key, right? Before the channeling started, Maya locked the door from the inside with that. The defendant herself locked the door? Yeah, that's why we all couldn't get the door open. That key's the only one of its kind, after all. Oh, one of a kind, you say? Wait, Mr. Phoenix Wright. Yes? It looks like she's catching on. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like there's a future between us. <laughs> I'm afraid to ask, but why is that key currently in your possession? Uh -huh. What do you mean? <laughs> I mean, literally. <laughs> if Maya Faye locked herself in, then the key should have been with her. Yes, agreed. However, she did not have the key at the time of her arrest. Ah! <laughs> well, ain't that a kick. So how come you're holding it? I got this as a present from a certain little girl. And that little girl was nowhere near the crime scene at the time. This, that's preposterous! Uh, this means that Maya Faye must have left the room. If she had not, then I would be not holding this key you see before you. <laughs> <laughs> no! Nine! Wow. Game over. It seems we have come to an impasse. This picture has clearly captured the face of the murderer. However, it is this person, is this person the defendant or not? No! This person has Bodon Honkaroos, <laughs> while the defendant does not. The defense is arguing that this person is not the defendant. <laughs> Some real humongo wonka 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 <laughs> Furthermore, as proof, this key has been submitted as evidence. Miss Von Karma. How can this be? At this point in time, a verdict on the defendant's guilt is not possible. My perfect case. How is there a flaw in my perfect case? I don't know. Don't think you've won yet, Mr. Phoenix Wright. I am a prodigy. I have never lost a case. Well, if you're a prodigy, that means you're very young and like you're like you haven't probably done a lot of cases then. Yeah. And I don't intend to use he lose here in the courtroom to a fool like you. Ow! <laughs> Stop! <laughs> <laughs> I don't care what I have to do. I will get my guilty verdict. Okay. Even if an innocent person has to go to jail? Yeah. That's enough. If you would like to continue, do so in the lobby, in the whipping chamber. <laughs> Court will reconvene tomorrow at 10 a.m. 10 a.m.? I'll bring my unwhipped bottom. <laughs> that is all. Court is insurance. <laughs> and whatever happens, happens. <laughs> hey, everybody. Wow, that was you pretty. Summon? I thought she said you summoned my ass. <laughs> <laughs> oh, goodness. Yes, I thought I had no choice. Great going, Pearly. I knew you were special. Hey, Nick, did you know? <laughs> Does he know? <laughs> um, yeah, it's not like anyone else in there could have done that. Hmm, Nick. I know you're trying really hard and all, but do better. <laughs> <laughs> I could go to fucking jail. Yeah. I really don't remember ever leaving that room. And I don't think a third person could have gone into that room. Yeah. No, I'm really winging it, dude. Yeah, I mean, you two children have definitely done better detective work than I have. <laughs> well, at least we have until tomorrow to figure things out. Right now, it's a huge mess. Like what happened in that room, for instance. How old is Maya supposed to be? I don't know. Yeah, I don't know either. All yeah, right. I'm counting on you. Somewhere between Mia and Pearl. Yeah, exactly. Uh, I envy the two of you. Oh, by the way, Nick, do, do you think that you could take Pearly back home for me? Sure. Oh, oh right, that's you. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Pearl, so you ready to go buy some tickets? Huh? A ticket? Poor thing. So sheltered. I'm gonna take her out for the night of the town. <laughs> it's just go to like a hookah bar and shit. <laughs> <laughs> You're drunk and passed out. And she's just like, um. <laughs> <laughs> she's just 
standing around <laughs> watching as you're getting totally fucking blitzed. <laughs> Pearl, hold my hair while I puke. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Welcome to the world, kid. All right. Karain Village, June 21st. Thank you very much for bringing me home, Mr. Nick. Oh, yeah, you're welcome. I had to come and look into a few things here today anyway. Uh, uh, um, I thought about this a little. Yeah? If Mystic Maya didn't kill that nice man... She definitely didn't. Definitely. <laughs> yes, of course. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. We, yeah sure, of course. sure, sure, sure. <laughs> but if she didn't, then someone else did, right? Good detective work. Um, that murderer person. Yes, Pearls. Oh, I see. What, were you hoping he's still alive or something? Yeah. I wonder what's wrong. She seems sad. Why are you sad? <laughs> oh, she's happy again. So what did you think of seeing your first trial? It was epic. I was really surprised. Super poggers! At how fucking insane a courtroom can be! <laughs> yeah. I'd never seen so many people before. Oh. Okay. What about my lawyering? It's pretty impressive. Yeah, right? it was good, right? It's super good. Just like, deeply fishing for compliments. <laughs> yeah. And Mystic Maya looked so small and helpless. And like, my hair looked Pretty good, Just right? the right level of spiky. <laughs> well, Maya's already naturally short, so... And then that snobby woman with the roughly clothes? You mean my girlfriend? Roughly? Oh, she means Francisca. She had such a bad attitude. Hell yeah. <laughs> she acted like she already decided that Mr. Mystic Maya did it. Yeah. I'm gonna tell her what I think of her tomorrow. Damn. No, don't ruin this for me, Pearl. <laughs> yeah. God damn it. I wouldn't miss tomorrow's trial for the world. Whoa, she's even hotter head on. <laughs> well, she's like, Phoenix? <laughs> this picture of this woman! Uh huh. <laughs> Go on. Well she, well, she, well, she's the opposite of a lawyer, a prosecutor, so her job is to prove people guilty. Is a prosecutor not a type of lawyer? Yeah, I think he means it's the opposite of an oh, attorney. Defense a deter it's yeah. defense attorney, yeah. They don't care if someone's innocent. Oh! <laughs> Calm down. <laughs> All right, chill out. <laughs> All I care about is if they win. That's terrible and also not accurate. Like, that's really fucking slanderous to <laughs> a lot of prosecutors. <laughs> but she's really a good prosecutor with a heart on the inside, right? Fuck no. There's no one like that. Oh All my god. Prosecutors <laughs> are the same. God damn. Well, come right out and say it. <laughs> well, he might have become a good guy. Eventually, <laughs> I miss him. He? Who are you talking about? Mr. Nick? Oh, Why are your cheeks flushed? No one. <laughs> Is that person Mystic Maya was talking about? Mr. Edgyworth? Shh, fuck. Don't speak his name. Uh, that was a long time ago. He's not around anymore. He took that big dick of his and <laughs> <laughs> skipped town. <laughs> <Huh>? <laughs> He clutched onto his force pride too fiercely and died for it. Wait, he died? Yeah. Did he die? I care. He died? Uh, I don't um, remember that. I don't remember. I mean, if he if he died, he's coming back for sure. Because I cannot accept this fan fiction in my head going uncompleted. Oh, that's too bad. That's that's all the best fan fiction. It's never completed. Oh, I guess you're right. It's always will they, won't they? By the way. Um, you wouldn't happen to know anything about who the murderer is, would you? What? What a weird thing to talk to about it, like a kid about. Why are you asking me? I don't know. No, I was just thinking earlier. You know. Oh shit! What if she was channeling the uh, the murderer? Oh my god! Because they'd be, the murderer was wearing the same, same kind of clothes. uniform. Oh dip! I didn't see anything. She didn't see anything, huh? Speaking of that, during the murder, where was Pearls and what was she oh, doing? Oh, man. And on top of that, this key. Just when did she pick this up? All right, Pearl. There's a thing called an alibi. <laughs> <laughs> Grab her by the shoulders and shake her. Why'd you kill him? <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Oh my god! <laughs> 
I just realized that I never asked you what you were doing at the time of the crime. Pearls. Where were you, and what were you doing when the murder Listen happened? This is music. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I was murdering, of course. <laughs> ah. <laughs> what I was doing? I wasn't doing anything. Uh, Certainly not murdering. She really wasn't bad lying. You can whisper it to me. I won't tell anyone else, except for everybody. <laughs> I promise. Uh-oh. Oh, damn. Kachak. Lock, lock. Two. Lock, lock, goose. Uh. Wait, did we unlock the stuff with Mia? No. No, we didn't. Okay. Because she has, she knows the solution. Oh. I guess you can see through my lie, huh? Oh, that's why she wouldn't want to, you know, give away Pearl, right? Maybe that's Mia's secret. She didn't want to give away Pearl? As, like, someone who was channeling a murderer. Oh, I see. Yeah, to, like, protect her. Yeah, clearly. I can't lie to you, can I, Mr. Nick? I mean, you can. Uh, I'm a freaking defense attorney. Okay, I'm gonna... Stop calling me. Hit the pause button? Uh, no, no, oh. I, I don't think I have anything. Oh, okay. That can uh, unlock anything. Boop -a -doop -boop -boop. Is this child a murderer? Although I suppose... I can at least ask her about the key. About this key, Pearls. You found it on the day of the murder, right? Yes. Now, where you found this key is very important. On the body of the guy I killed! You can't- uh. <laughs> 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 So please tell me, Pearls, where did you find this? Um, I found it in the incinerator. Oh, jeez. Uh -oh. <laughs> it's like Phoenix pulls out a gun and like points it at her face. Where's the fucking find this? <laughs> you tell me where you found it! The incinerator? Wait, is she talking about the one in the garden? Yeah, dude, the only fucking incinerator. Yeah. The door and it was a little open, so I took a peek. <laughs> like, <laughs> <today. laughs> where was that? It was after the channeling when everyone was in a panic. A panel. Mm. Um, Mr. Nick? Yeah? Do you want to tell my mother? Huh? You mean, tell Morgan what you did? Yes, if she finds out that I was playing in the leftover trash, I'll get us thanking. Jesus, okay. Uh, I, uh, yeah. I guess I'll tell her I was playing this. <laughs> <laughs> I'll take this bullet for you, Pearl. <laughs> <laughs> That's how great a guy I am. <laughs> Let's keep it a secret from her then, all right? Don't you say a fucking word. <laughs> <laughs> well, the incinerator, huh? Sounds like a good place to search next. Hopefully Morgan's there and I can just hit him. <laughs> oh no! Here I am, going through the incinerator! <laughs> Such a bad boy! Hope no one finds me! <laughs> Jeez. It's really empty. Training was supposed to be held today, but I guess it's already over. Uh, let's fucking move. Let's go to the incinerator. Oh my god, there's stuff over there. Oh yeah, there sure is. Hey, there's someone by the incinerator. Oh, looks like they noticed me. And are now running at top speed towards me! Oh. Uh, hey, huff huff. Like, huff huff. You're that dentist guy. Actually, it's Phoenix Wright, attorney at law. Nice to see you again. Oh, like, real suave. So, it's like my turn. It's nice to see you, too. So, what's up? You're all out of breath. Just burning a body, like, huh? Oh, like, you mean, like, I'm just totally happy and, like, totally excited to be here. Excited? Like, I mean, there are so many things to, like, see. It's, like, the real deal here. You ever notice how she never opens her eyes? Yeah, ever. It's because she has the same eyes as her sister. Oh. Yeah. Oh, really? For example? For example, like, that urn over there. Do you, like, know about it? Oh, I see. It's an old cracked piece of pottery. I thought it was, like, a cutesy way characters are drawn in Japan sometimes. I mean, yes. Okay. But I think it's like a, you know... Uh, something, like a reveal. Yeah, she's gonna be on... She, uh, mark my words, yes. she's gonna be on the stand, and then... They're, and things will start to unravel. And then she's gonna open her eyes, and it's gonna be like, Oh, fuck! Yeah. She looks just like her! Yeah. 
That's right. Pearl says she found this key inside the incinerator. I guess I should take a look inside for myself. This, this, this is from Maya's costume. <laughs> <laughs> Where's the producer? Yeah. There's blood on it. A tiny bit, but still. Yeah, I'm a defense attorney, but what I really want to do is direct. <laughs> It's a really old urn. There are ashes of a person long dead inside. Looks like someone with a long history. Other than that, let's move on. Alright. I'm gonna go ahead and give this fucking thing to her and be like, What the hell were you doing? Are you just carrying a gun on around you? With you? It's just one of the evidence things. Oh, okay. Like, I'm really sorry, but- And I know, like, you totally had your hope. Oh. What? She oh. not say anything about this? Alright. Let's talk to her. Is there some sort of legend connected with that urn? As I am. Like, yeah, it's like this village's treasure. Huh. I didn't know that. And like, it's sealed inside and that, that urn, um... Um, it's? Oh. What are you talking the, about? The treasure is in the urn. Not the urn itself. Oh, I see. Like, you know... Amy Faye's spirit? Amy Faye? Who's that? Like, jeez, Mr. Smith. Get with the program. Everyone knows the lady that founded the Korean channeling technique was Mystic Annie. Um, you don't have to get upset with me. So, like, as long as her spirit, like, lives in that urn, the spiritual power of the Faye family will stick around. Like, isn't that totally romantic? Uh, <laughs> the romantic, huh? Oh, if that urn is really as important as she says, it could be a vital clue. Ha true, a clue. Any, I want to ask you about the murder. Murder? What is that? Dr. Fucking. Ugh, as if there's another one? Oh, that one. Like, you should have said so in the first place. <laughs> so, like, I totally don't know anything because I was, like, sleeping in the side room. Ah, uh, yeah. Well, that's not much help. Did you notice anything at all? Like maybe like a bloody guy or maybe <laughs> like a burned piece of clothing in an incinerator or that, the one that you ran over from yeah. just now? Like come on, what a total bore. Okay. I like totally have nothing to do with this. Like murder thing. Oh. Yeah. You only introduced Dr. Gray to Korean Village, no relation, sure. Even if you were only a Quantan says. You, that still means you knew him. Furthermore, your sister who died in that accident was a nurse at this clinic. This is like actual words come out. It's like, oh. Oh, sorry, <laughs> sorry. I thought I was trying to think that. My bad. I said the quiet part. <laughs> All right, then. Why don't you tell me about your sister's fatal accident? Like, why? You think, like, it's got something to, like, do with the murder? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I don't oh, know yet, God. but I'm trying to chase down every lead I can, and, you know, the whole thing that anybody would want to take revenge on this guy for, yeah, I'm gonna look into it. Okay. Jack. Psy. Psylox. Like, what is it? My favorite X-Man. Looks like I'm going to need something to pry her mouth open on this one. Hmm. Uh... Well, let's take a look on what it could possibly be. We got all kinds of Vidans here. Hmm. Like E Vidans. Aha, uh -huh, nice. I don't think I have anything. The Silox always seem like pretty like, oh shit. Yeah. You know? It, yeah, it's it's a it's a big deal. Hmm. Alright, let's go see Le Le Bloodstain. Okay. Channeling Shamba. Ah, the Channeling Shambe. Hmm. Looks like Morgan's here too, but she hasn't noticed me yet. Morgan Freeman? <laughs> yeah. I can smell you. <laughs> I wonder who did this murder. <laughs> <laughs> I ponder as I look off into the distance. What is she doing? It looks like she's talking to a picture. Wow. <laughs> Never has anyone looked more innocent. <laughs> I know. Don't you see? Take a look around. Finally, my chance has come. I've waited for this day for so long. That's right. Prepare yourself, dear, Missy. What in the fuck? Who's there? 
<laughs> I was just here drinking my tea. Oh, Willy Pitches and Mr. Right. I'm um, just curious with that picture you were just looking at. Picture? <laughs> oh, today was that event, was it not, good sir? I heard you did well. Huh? Oh, yeah, thanks. I'm terribly sorry I could not attend the trial today. Please accept my apology. Yeah, whatever. I had a previous engagement as I had to watch over the trainee's training today. I get the sense she really doesn't want to talk about the picture. All because the master can't be here with us, you understand? And that is why a lowly branch family member such as myself must do this. Okay. What happened? <laughs> Have you remembered anything about the murder? No, I told you everything I know already. Uh-huh. <laughs> Meanwhile, she's the smartest person alive, and that's all brain. It's not hair. It, like you just shave it, and like she's <laughs> got a huge cranium. Oh my god! <laughs> Were you in this room the whole time when Lada and I went to call the police? Yes, of course. I was by Mystic Maya's side the entire time. I performed the spirit severing technique and held her in my arms afterward. Mm. You said that yesterday as well. Did anything else happen? I would like to say more did. However, that is all I heard. That is all that occurred. Huh. What? You think she was in on it? I, I've, I've suspected her for a while. Wow. But like, I don't know if they would do something like that because she's Pearl's mom, which would be effed up, but maybe the game would. Well, she mentioned that Maya is like the sole inheritor of the the like Fey Manor. Yes, and she's she seems to have a problem with being a branch member of the family yeah. instead of the main line. So there's some motivation for jealousy there. Yeah. Ah, oh, I was really hoping for some new info. Hm. I suppose nothing happened in the end, good sir. Sorry to have played on your hopes. Could you possibly be more patronizing? Maybe you should subscribe to our Patreon at patreon.com slash gamegrumps. It's the best place to patronize. <laughs> So, do the students train every day? Yes, absolutely. They were given a day off the day after the murder. Of course. <laughs> it's a holiday, however. No day. Happy murder day. And I assume both Maya and Pearls went through this training. Mr. Wright. That's uh, the other yes. reason I think she might be bad. Just because, like, from the beginning, she's had, like, this weird dark side. Yeah. That's, like, frightening to everyone. Well, she got real scary real fast. How many times must I tell you before you understand, good sir? They are to be addressed as Mystic Maya and Mystic Pearl. <sighs> sorry, I meant Mystic Maya and Mystic Pearl. Wait, I'm sorry, but Mystic Pearl? Isn't that going a bit too far? Next question, please. Oh man, she's really being a pain in the butt about this. Please remember to watch not only what you say, but how you say it, good sir. Right, 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 right. Yeah. So the master is, um, Maya's mother, right? Mystic Misty. <laughs> She's a brilliant medium. Uh -huh. Mystic Misty the medium. <laughs> medium Mystic Misty. Magical Misty Mr. Mr. Mistopheles. Yeah, Mr. Yes, Mr. Meme. I miss her, Mystic Misty. I miss her so much. And where is she now? We are not sure. Not sure? About 16 or 17 years ago, Mystic Misty failed at channeling a certain spirit. And after that, she simply disappeared. Okay. Only to come back now to murder some- I, uh, I don't believe she will return to this village in any case. And in four years' time, we will have a new president. Her name will forever be erased from this village. Erased? A person who has been away from the village for over 20 years is considered dead. Oh, I see. And that is four years from now for her. When that happens, a new master will be appointed to Korean village. And... Mystic Maya was supposed to become the next master. Mystic Maya, the mysterious Mystic Master? <laughs> However, with this murder, I'm afraid... The murder of Mystic Maya in the mysterious manner of Mystic... <laughs> I must be imagining things. I thought she was laughing to herself for a second there. Yeah. yeah. Cause Some, she's something's fucking, very off. She's fucking evil, dude. Yo, she's fucking evil. Let's fucking go. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, oh, hey, <laughs> sorry, I forgot you were here. Uh, let's go talk to Maya. Hey, Maya, your uh, aunt is fucked. So weird. Hey, Nick, 
I've been wondering, do you think love can bloom on a battlefield? <laughs> she looks so hopeless. Helpless. So, so helpless. So, so how was it? What did you find out? Um, well, I found a few things. Is it so bad that you can't even look me in the eye? I, I just need a little more time. Just give me some more time! It'll all come together by tomorrow, I promise. M meanwhile, your wandering eyes are because you have a crush on the guard. Yeah. Oh, Chris, how are you? <laughs> so, you can't even look me in the eye! And you're like, oh god, no, what are his abs like? <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> I can tell just by the way the shirt drapes on his body that he's got a six pack. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, Nick. Every time I see you, all I do is cause trouble. Trouble. So how was it? Today's trial, I mean. Pretty epic, right? You were fantastic, Nick! Every time I thought our goose was cooked, you managed to turn it all around. I bet it would make a great Hollywood movie. Don't be silly. We have to concentrate on the trial. We're gonna win this, Maya. Thanks a lot. Really? Hey, Nick. The person who shot Dr. Gray wasn't me, was it? Of course not. You're completely innocent. If that were true, then I'd be really happy. But there wasn't anyone else in the room with the two of us, right? Well, it seems like there might have been like five or six other people. Yeah. Did you check behind the folding screen? Um, I took a quick glance, but there wasn't anyone there. Hmm. That's exactly what Lara said, too. Interesting. Um, Nick? Yeah? Why do you believe in me? Why do you think I didn't kill Dr. Gray? Because fucking look at you. Because <laughs> of something Mia told me. My sis? What did she tell you? Tell me what the fuck she told you! <laughs> she said that spirit mediums can't have dreams. When you're channeling, it's impossible for you to dream because your soul leaves you and shit. Now that you mentioned it, wait! Then, then, I really am? You are not the real murderer. But for some reason, that piece of evidence is not admissible in court. <laughs> yeah. I think that maybe before you even called the spirit, you were drugged. Drugged? I think this was planned from the very beginning. She's coming up with a cockamamie shit. Yeah. I think the government. <laughs> Aliens. <laughs> <laughs> and you were set up to take the blame for killing Dr. Gray. That's, that's the dumbest shit I've ever heard. <laughs> it's really stupid. <laughs> I want to ask you something about Pearls. Pearly? What about her? No matter what I try, she won't answer me. I want to know what she was doing at the time of the murder. Huh? Wait, Nick, you don't think she did it, do you? No, no. Well, <laughs> nothing sure like depends. that. She never did anything like that, you hear me? Never! She's a great kid, and really cute, and really great, and cute. <laughs> I don't really think she was the murderer. But, she's definitely hiding something. You were with her on that day, right? Yeah, I, two of us, we were playing with her ball. And I threw it and I went, fetch! And she went, <laughs> A ball, huh? Sounds like a dead end to me. Ball. What's, what's the deal with ball? <laughs> so about this dead end ball. <laughs> it's nothing really special. It's just a plain old ball. I think she was still playing with her when I started the channeling job that day. Pearly really loves to play with that ball. She likes to slobber all over it and chew on it. She's kind of curled up in the corner on the ground. Big fan of fetch. <laughs> she loves to play with that ball, huh? When she wants to get it, she always climbs right in the clothing box. The clothing box? Yeah. Pearly's always hiding in there. You know, the side room? There's a clothing box in there. It's really big, so once you sit, I'm sure you'll know what I'm talking about. Is that the one in front of, like, the beds on the floor? Yeah. Clothing box in the side room, huh? Interesting. I'm gonna go check out the fucking clothing box. Yeah. See ya. Oh, fuck. Is there a murderer in here? Like, you swing the box over. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> ah! 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 Oh. Hey, wait, please, Lotta! She ran off into the manor. Oh, she forgot her manners. <laughs> nice. Okay. Right. Ironic. <laughs> Isn't that cool? Lotta! Ah! Hey! I'm- Oh. I'm telling you, quit following me, you hear? Okay. I'm a worthless piece of trash. You lay your eyes on me and they'll turn to dust. <sighs> okay. That's- I don't- That's- that's Medusa. Okay. Uh... I just examined the urn, right? 
It's a spirit in the stern, huh? Oh, this is a bunch of cracks, but I guess maybe the spirit could live in the space between the cracks. It's like something. Do you know how spirits it. work? <laughs> yeah, I am, huh? Weird. All right. Okay. Dick, oh yeah, sucking that dick, oh yeah. <laughs> Sorry. So no, song in my no, no need to apologize, Aaron. Mm -hmm. I know you. I'm pretty sure I saw a lot of run in this direction with a lot of haste. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> okay, next time I do. <laughs> <laughs> God, I love to end with a winner. <laughs> We're getting pretty deep into this, man. I know, dude. Yeah, it's starting to come together. Trial number Juan. Hell yeah. We will see you all shortly. Yeah, boy. Goodbye.